See you later, Van. See you tomorrow. Love you too. squeaking going on in my backpack. All right, so here we go. This is my first overnight backpacking trip of the year. I'm doing an easy hike because of my knee. I want to make sure I can handle carrying this weight. So <clears throat> I've been uh, kind of rehabbing my knee on my own for many months. And it's doing pretty well. Just gotta take it easy, take it slow. Don't do anything stupid. I got trekking poles if I need the help. Beautiful day, man. Nice cool breeze. But I haven't eaten much. I had oatmeal and a banana. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna eat this thing. Peanut butter. Breakfast of champions. I'm sure there's ticks all over the place. I treated my clothing yesterday, or the day before. Sprayed it all. My shirt, socks, shoes. Frog Lake. Flat Frog Trail. Straight? No. Great sign. All right, it's this way. I'm pretty sure I came up this road last time. Nice. Flowers. Howdy ho. Yep, we're hiking. We're backpacking. It's steep. Maybe you step off this. You're <laughs> Here if I don't bump my backpack on the tree and push myself off. Eh, there we go. Nice views all around. My knee's fine, I got a knee brace on, and uh, it's doing good. No problems at all. Haven't gone down any hills either, so that's usually where the, you know, where the fun starts. Nice day. It's good to be out here. This isn't like being at the park 
down the road and hiking. This is, I'm out here, you know. Not real far, but definitely a different experience. Here we go. This is where I wanted to rest. We got a little over a mile ago <clears throat> to the camp spot. Beautiful day out here. I'm in no hurry to get to camp because once I do, I gotta work. I gotta set up my tent, get all my stuff unpacked and arranged. There's an oak everywhere. Uh, all right, I'm into the lake. Whew. Definitely gonna have to come back here with my fishing rod. Wow, look at that. The spring was barely dripping last time I was here. That is flowing. I can get it right out of the pipe. On the table. Well, we're here. We made it. All right, here we are. Nice little camp spot. It's pretty flat right here for the tent. First thing I'm gonna do is eat. I'm gonna have one of these sausages here. And if you think that sausage looks funky, it's because it is. It is a plant-based sausage. I did not bring a cooking kit. Too heavy. Let's see how this works. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Vegan sausage, bread, and mustard. Good enough. I did find out that this place had a picnic table before I came. I got no problem with that. Figured if my knee gave me a problem or if I was tired. Hey man, I don't know. First trip of the year. Just testing out my gear. Make sure my tent stands up still. I want to go up to the Sierras this year, but I think my trips are going to be delayed because of the snowpack. It's just going to be torrential river. What do you call it? Raging rivers. When all that, uh, snow melts and uh, it's just going to be dangerous conditions up there in a lot of places so a lot of people's trips are going to be put off because of that. I don't have any fishing gear so I'm going to have to think of something to do. I'm going to go for a hike probably later. So what do we got this time? I've got gloves, got a headlamp, let's see I got a pillow 
If you remember my last video, my pillow sucked. My pillow sucked. This must be my footprint that goes under my tent. Just keep things from poking through. Sleeping bag, tent, tent stakes, toiletries and sunscreen and bug spray and uh, stuff there. I've got a sleeping bag liner because it's gonna be cold tonight. That's supposed to knock 20 to 25 degrees off of my coldness. Yeah, we'll see about that. This is my air mattress. Yes, I brought a hammer. Folks, I've got tendonitis and using rocks and big branches and stuff to hammer in my tent stakes kind of aggravates my arm. So I figured I'd try this. It was seven bucks. It's seven ounces, so it's got some weight to it on my backpack, but I think that's going to help me. Going to try it. My trekking poles that I have not used yet. I need those to set up my tent. Here's all my clothes. I got food and water over here. Got a bug net in here in case I need to wear it. Uh, oh, we forgot about the shovel. We'll use that in the morning probably. That'll be exciting. All right, let's get the tent set up. I don't think I need the footprint. I don't I need nothing that's gonna stick to my tent. <laughs> sure what's what just yet. There we go. Hey. I'm liking the hammer. I am. This thing <laughs> makes it so much easier. <clears throat> Say what you want. I'm digging it. I am digging the hammer. I I'm doing all this right. Tell you what, this is some pretty hard ground. <clears throat> this plastic hammer is putting the stakes right in. Jeez. Maybe it helps us shut the door. Zip the door. Keep everything together until I get it up. Probably tighten this a little bit. Now I can get some of my stuff in the tent, stash it away, and maybe go for a hike. All right, I got my super cool <laughs> air mattress with an inflator on it. I'm supposed to step on it and use your foot, but I don't want to get it all dirty. There we go. It's just about full. Everyone needs a pillow, dude. Four breaths and it's full. Yeah. I have a feeling when I land this thing, it's just gonna go thunk and squirt right out because of uh, the slickness of my sleeping bag, but maybe I can stick my boots or something behind it and hold it in place. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go for a little hike. I'm gonna go about two miles. I'm gonna bring a sweater and I'm gonna bring now I have a really cool jacket at home. Looks really cool. This is the not so cool liner. I mean, look at that. <laughs> but uh, I want to bring this too. Going on a little adventure. Should I just fill it from there? Nah, I don't know if I can get it in there. Screw the filter on, like so, and just squeeze it in into here. Cheers. Ah, it's good, and it's cold.
Frog Lake, Fish Trail. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, there's a bench over here. Let's check it out. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, wow. There we go. That's what I came up here to see. According to the map, it's over a thousand feet to the bottom of the valley, which you can't see. That is nice. Look at that view. Hey! Glad you could join me. Nice having you around. Stick with me, man. We're going down to the lake. It's going to be cool. My camp is over there somewhere. Nice. I love it. It's coming after me. It's charging me. I gotta get out of the way. <laughs> Here's my campsite from last year. Frog Lake Camp. Ooh, yeah, it's full. <laughs> Sitting here at Frog Lake, just kicking back, enjoying the early evening. Just had an apple, listening to the birds, watching the birds, just checking it out, see what happens here. It's not too exciting back at camp, so I'm not in any hurry to go back. I've been hanging out here at the lake for a while, uh, getting a little cool. I figured I'd go back to camp, make sure uh, no animals stole my food that I hung up, and uh, I don't know, just get ready for the evening. Oh my god, look at all those fry. Hundreds of baby, baby bass probably. Heading back to camp after visiting Frog Lake for a little while. Just saw a cool little lizard. Uh, Home sweet home. Tent's still standing. That's a great sign. Just got back to camp, getting situated. I'm trying to think of what to eat, and I chose tuna creations, hot buffalo. Oh yeah. I haven't been eating meat hardly at all, but um I am today. No bread. I've got one more sausage, but I think I'm gonna have that tomorrow. So I'm just gonna eat this plain. wrong about the tent, but what's up? Ooh, that's pretty hot. I like this camp spot. It's really cool. It's more isolated than the other one for sure. Oh, here's some turkeys. I'm trying my new, uh, or my, my jacket liner here. I don't know why they made it this color, but uh, what the heck? It's kind of cool, isn't it? You want one, don't you? You know you do. I got a couple hours of daylight left, though. I'll figure out what to do. Sun is going down. It's getting a bit chilly, but uh, I feel fine with this. Uh, my body held up pretty good. Legs got tired kind of... I felt like they got tired kind of early coming up to camp, but, uh, you know, I haven't really 
had a chance to work them out really hard because of my knee and stuff, so feels good to be out here. It's quiet. I saw one person about a mile out on the trail walking the other way, and ever since then I haven't seen a single person. I haven't heard anybody. There was nobody fishing at the lake. Nothing at all. I'm starting to hear things. I'm concerned about it. Yes? He kept hearing a man's voice telling him over and over that he was going to be murdered. Figured I'd li listen to one episode of The Whistler. Old time radio. What the heck? I listen to this stuff when I go to bed at night a lot of the times just to help put me to sleep. I'm just waiting for the sun to go down. I want to take some shots of the moon and uh, you know, I'm just kind of waiting. All right, back to the whistler. <laughs> Drum set, something to do. Now my tent looks better. I forgot to hook these straps up before. There's little straps that go on each corner that pull the tarp out. You can see right here. And they were just dangling there. Yeah, now it looks good. Very peaceful out here right now. Hear some birds. Hear the wind hitting the trees a little bit, but it's dying down a lot. The sun's just about behind the hills there. I like it. All right, it's just about dark now. Um, it's getting cold, but I'm cool for now. Seems like all the birds have uh, quieted down. I'm surprised I don't hear any crickets. I am out here by myself. I don't think there's anybody around me for miles. I'm in bed, in my sleeping bag, in my liner. I feel like I'm gonna be warm, but I don't know. It's gonna get a lot colder tonight got two hopes for the evening well I got a bunch of hopes but the main one is I hope I don't have to get up and pee for quite a while because it's a pain to get in here <laughs> a little bit anyway and when it's gonna be colder outside forget it and I hope I can get some sleep it's 9 40 p.m. I had a great day thanks for joining me there'll be more tomorrow so see you then Good night. Hi there. It's 2.25 in the morning. A lot later than I thought it was, so I must have slept more than I thought. I heard some owls for the first two hours, I suppose. And uh, it's so quiet out here that, I mean, they were far away. But I could still hear just enough to... Hold my attention so I couldn't sleep. Just got up because nature called. Anyway, said I'd check in. I'm gonna go back to bed. Good morning. It's uh, not even six o'clock yet, but uh, nature called, so I answered. Hearing turkeys <laughs> and other birds, and uh, I'm a little hungry, so I think I'm gonna get a snack.
I am officially awake now. It's uh, about 8.45. Took a nap for, I don't know, I don't remember when I got in there, a couple hours, I guess. Outside of my tent was wet. The inside of my rain fly was wet, but not me. The inside of the tent was dry, worked perfectly. My sleeping bag liner worked great. I was toasty warm. It was really nice. I slept pretty bad, but uh, I guess I slept off and on. I definitely got some sleep. I'm gonna eat something and uh, I'll just kick back for a little while. Got camp torn down and uh, put away. I'm ready to leave anytime I want. I'm gonna hang out for a little bit and just kind of wake up a little more and stretch out and I'm in no hurry. I'm ready to go. Started heading back. I gotta filter some water for the hike and then on my way. All right, you win. Beautiful. Ferns, poison oak, lots of poison oak. Pretty cool little spot right here. A lot of flowers out, man. Pretty cool. Oh, look at this guy. I don't think you're getting up that part, dude. That's really smooth. You're stuck, buddy. I think you're stuck, dude. Now he's, he's not getting up that part. You have to turn around, I think, or fall. <sighs> yeah, you do not want to step off of that. You're going way down, and it's there's rocks down there. You're you're screwed if you do that. If you wanted to, you could go around this side of the tree, I suppose. It's not a big deal. I mean, it's an easy <laughs> pass, but still, it's it's something. Lose your balance at the wrong moment. You're gonna be in trouble. 
See? <laughs> you fall right here, you are not stopping until you hit those rocks. You will not be in good shape. I'm a little over half a mile now from the visitor center. Just about done. Hey, just want to thank you guys for coming along. Hope you had a good time. I did. It was interesting. Uh, I learned a few things. I learned that I need to work out my legs more. And I need to try and lighten my pack a little bit. It's kind of ridiculous. But it was a great two days. Totally glad I came. This place is beautiful right now. Good weather for hiking and backpacking. I recommend it. So, I have some bigger trips planned. I'm just not sure how I'm going to do them because of the snowpack up in the Sierras. It's causing problems, as I said. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. We'll do some more backpacking soon. Maybe get some fishing done at Frog Lake back there. Check out those fish. Anyways, till next time, see you on the trail.